Welcome back. You don't have any rations. You'd better get some food soon. Oh. oh, I must thank you for saving our time. You've brought joy back again into our lives, and we are in your debt. Yes. Debt. Hmm. Debt. Oh. It looks pretty much as you'd expect. <coughs> like a me. child. The child looks like ex as you expect it to look like. Like a child. Mm hmm Child, feed me! It's a typical country breakfast. Fried beets and a sausage with garlic for, with a, for a garnish. I don't know how we think, would ever thank you enough. <laughs> it is such a joy to have my little Tanya back home again. Oh, such big chubby chicks. Oh, oh. No. Now I smoke. <laughs> Tanya, I'm gonna smoke. I didn't like him. He didn't like me. He didn't like Katrina either. They were always having fights, but he had to do what she told him to. That made him very bad. I liked Trina. She was kind to me and she gave me lots of nice things. She even taught me to read and write. Still, so I'll never go back to her. I want to stay with my mommy and daddy. Good plan. Uh-huh. My creepy eyes. Just stare at you. I'm happy to be home again. Everyone in town has come to see me and talk to me. It's fun to be important. I will never marry. Uh. There is no one of my age. Maybe I'll marry the... the... Igor. The, I don't know. I mean, really, who else have I got left to be with? Uh. Yep. <laughs> Toby was my best friend in all the world. I missed him. I wish he could come home and live with us. But I guess he lives oh. inside me now. No, he, he did. <laughs> oh god, her face. My Tanya is her cheerful, loving self again. I can never thank you enough for the kindness you have oh. shown us all. I knew Tanya was alive somewhere. I never lost hope that she would return. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bella, you heard his story. Tanya was dead, an undead, a Nosferatu who turns off the light. She is fine right now, isn't she? As long as she is alive, well, what yes. else matters? I do not understand this talk about vampires and Tanya. She is returned happy and healthy and I've lost a bit. Of course, I will never forget the woman who stole my baby from me. Still, I can understand her a little. I too always wanted a child like Tanya. And then I mistreated her. Oh. And then I, my eyebrows wiggled. Oh. But uh, yeah, I am overjoyed to have my Tanya back. Yes. You want to come in the back room? Oh, she is her joyful self again. The sound of a child's voice is the sweetest of music. We will do our best to show her our love and never let her be afraid of the dark again. Mm. I have always found it difficult to express emotion. Mordavian men... No! Oh, I'm crying. Mordavian men are not supposed <laughs> to show such things. Yet I cried freely when you brought Tanya back to us. I cannot remember ever being so happy. Yes. <sighs> I do not know what to make of Tanya's stories about the vampires. It is hard to imagine my lovely daughter as an undead. <laughs> Gladly I would go to the castle though and drive a stake through the heart of one who stole our daughter from us. Now I want a stake. Mm, stake. Mm, stake. Oh, mm. Talk about Toby's sacrifice. That sounds good. You, you remind the innkeeper that the vampires are still in the castle and there may be <laughs> other attempts at getting Tanya. Vampires. <laughs> oh, we understand that we will make assert that no vampires can come near here ever again. More garlic. You tell about how Toby sacrificed himself for Tony. Oh, he may have looked like a monster, but he obviously had a heart and mind of great kindness. Yes. I miss him. No, absolutely not. 
You hear a chorus of responses, some coming from the kitchen. Goodbye and thank you! Goodbye and thank you! Yes! Thank I you for calling the Nintendo Support Hotline! Uh, okay, uh, okay! Oh, you have brought back <laughs> real joy to Mordavia. Yes, I know! When she was stolen, it was like all the laughter here had been taken as well. You gave us back our happiness. Do I look happy? Yes. I am happy. <laughs> You're never happy, Dimitri. You brought happiness. Do we have everything, like, maxed out, or...? Um... In the middle? Like, uh, yeah. Yes. Boy. Okay, okay. Yeah. Big we're, locks, we're, we're pretty... weapon use, climbing, yeah, yeah that's we're, all we're at, pretty... at 300 or over. We're, we're, we're pretty, we're pretty um, overpowered. <sighs> Apart from luck. Super luck is not 300. Uh, who needs luck? But yeah, so we are basically now heading for the end game, so we might as oh, well wow. save. Um, I know bitch please um so we've got to get these uh rituals so that we can uh perform the final final sacrifice not sacrifice uh the final final solution basically um and we have uh two of these oh these these already, paper things know. there yeah so we've already got two so we need to get the other three oh the days are getting colder and shorter winter is approaching Win winter, winter is, is coming. coming. Brace yourselves. Um, whoa, Nelly. Oh, God. Oh, the talk is you're a real <laughs> hero. People say you've returned a little tan to appearance. My, <laughs> my, my. my. Mm. Ahoy. <laughs> mm. <laughs> oh, God. What do I need? What do I need? <laughs> Boop. Yeah, I need some trail rations because I don't have any food at the moment so it's always good to have a couple of those oh yeah mm, so much food i don't think we need any more food oh just buy one why don't we buy a broom <laughs> uh, oh, you never know you when you need another broom <laughs> <laughs> everything i think we only need the one <laughs> <laughs> I heard you did really, you had a really great adventure bringing Tanya back from that awful castle. Did you really have to fight hundreds of horrible monsters without even a sword? Yes, absolutely. That's, wonderful. That's what we did. I mean, there wasn't even anyone there. <laughs> Dimitri was a really nice man. It's a shame the nasty things people have said about his family. People shouldn't spread such rumors, as I always say. There used to be a very active adventurers guild here in town, but it's been empty and locked up since I can remember. Mm. Dr. Cranium is a strange man. No one even knows what goes on in that back room of his house. I mean, he may be effing that thing. I don't know, you know. Mark mm -hmm. my words. Mm. I think he calls it Frankie. Good night, and don't let the bug buds bite, as my husband used to, and I guess still does say. Now. No, I don't say that. Am I... Oh. Oh, my bladder. Oh, no. Mm. Oh, oh, dear. Oh, no. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Darkness. Darkness is despair. Is I've come to talk us. with you again. Well, we might as well give da, these da, fellas da, a big da, shout da, out. Da, da, da. No dear. Da, 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 da. And the vision. <laughs> <laughs> Many monsters roam the night in Mordavia. Many eldered creatures crawl in the dark. <laughs> Good thing we stay safe within the town walls, <laughs> so we don't have to meet them. Oh, very well. Maybe we got them once in a while. 
<laughs> Perhaps we do tell some things that occasion about others occasionally. <laughs> but we never repeat gossip, so try to get it straight the first time we tell it. Uh, actually, the gossip is about you, baby. Someone overheard Tanya playing with the stuff used to be. She was singing Tanya's and love trainers and human dreams and love. <gasps> Since you're not the only human having any dealings with vampires. We thought you might be interested in the story. Why is it <laughs> your purpose? You can never get around the people on this year of gossip. God, that voice hurts. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> There's a pretty quiet around here. Yuri and Bella are happy that Tanya's back. He goes back to his old self, and we even occasionally talk to him now. We're bastards. <laughs> There's even a rumor that Boris and Olga may be getting together again. On the other hand, it's all vampires in the castle. And the swamp still cuts us up from the rest of the world. Oh, oh. <laughs> and the dark, well, the cave still influences everything that goes on in Mordavia, yeah. So we are a little curious about you, baby. When are you gonna get around to taking care of all the rest of our problems? Excuse me? Yeah, problems. <laughs> <laughs> you're the hero around here. My bum hurts. You'll start to tell them of your plans and the dangers you face. Oh no, don't tell them anything. Maybe it's better we don't know about all the details. Yeah, I don't think we'll sleep better if we don't. <laughs> Dad, we don't want to know what gives us nightmares. I can tell you about my crotch, it hurts. <laughs> he was thrust in our clothes and wore a hood over his head so we could not quite see his face. <laughs> He's barking at each civil and rising at a cruel chuckle. <laughs> it hurts. <laughs> By the next day, all the elephants had left Moldavia. Excuse me, elephants? I can't bear this, you yep. tell it. Only the stranger was left in town. We went up to him and said, What have you done? What did you say to the elephants, sir? <laughs> then he threw off his clothes and cape and revealed that he was an elephant. <laughs> he said, Oh, you fools, I am an elephant. <laughs> Oh, I think you've spoiled the story. And then he packed up his drug and left forever. <laughs> oh. But to this day, on a dark, cold night, you can still hear the, desk the distant echoes of elephants trumpeting their mournful calls. Going, Nelly the elephant packed the trunk. And I call out, you forgot to write to the elephants do not listen and they never remember trumpeting. <laughs> oh, God. Trump? <laughs> Trump, Trump, Trump. Oh, I God, fucking Nelly hate the them. It's just gonna... I hate <laughs> them so much. <laughs> oh, you never have to speak to them ever again. Oh, oh, it is very dangerous in Moldavia tonight. We all keep things locked up. But, uh, yes, I will let you out. Mm. Yeah, whatever. Thank you. I am standing yeah. on a stool. Ah, it's still not dark enough. Well, let's have a nap in Arana's garden. Oh, damn. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Bing! And suddenly, it's night time. <laughs> 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 Who time turned to off the lights? over the fence. <laughs> okay, let's just uh, sneak over here. Um, let's sneak out <laughs> okay. over here. I am uh, pissed yeah, off. Yeah, let's go, let's go meet. I will piss off yes. now. Oh, yes. Oh, slut. <laughs> oh, slut. Death, yes. Death waits beyond those gates, at least for those 
tough enough for the challenge. It comes in the form of two slavery oh. necrotos. She's no. not here. All right. Well, guess we'll walk back this way. That's how we roll in Moldavia. Yes. We be good people. Yep, guess she's not here. So, uh, let's uh, go do the next bit to uh, go back in town. Head back to our room. Climb up. <laughs> that didn't do anything. There we go. <laughs> Climb up the, in here. Have another nap. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, sleeping. there we go. Sleep until morning. Yay! Yeah, sleep until morning. Yeah. Oh! You awaken and as the sun begins to rise, and here's something for you. Indeed. The note says, Meet me at the castle gates tonight. We have much to talk about. Katrina. Do we? Do we really, Katrina? <laughs> and then she became yes. a hurricane. And destroyed <laughs> everything. <laughs> Oh god. Oh yes. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh my god. Feed me. You eat your best with you feed me. Why does she always have to smoke like next to me when I'm eating? That's well... disgusting. Oh good day. <laughs> my aunt used to do that. She used to uh, smoke while other people were eating. Oh. It's fucking Ugh. disgusting. Goodbye, everybody. Yes, goodbye. <laughs>